Hi guys, today I want to talk about something very close to my heart and that is my addiction to stationery and you've probably heard about addictions to alcohol, drugs, that sort of thing but you might not have heard of addiction to stationery so I'm going to show you all of my stationery well not all of it because that would take far too long but I'm going to show you a few of the things that I like to get a lot of these are just a small selection of my many notebooks and two of which I got tonight so I'll just show you them I made this one I got like a little book thing and then I put wrapping paper over it to make it all fancy then I've got my character profiles for Nana Remo that last year I never really followed through just got all my little character profiles got this one which has like three pages left because I ended up ripping them all out because I start an old book hoping that it's going to be all perfect and clean it never ends up being like that so I just end up ripping all the pages out so it's got like three pages left in it but I love the neon then I have these sparkly hologram ones I'm not sure if it's going to show up on the camera but they're all like holographic if that's how you say it got all my YouTube video ideas and stuff in that then I have this gorgeous cupcake one then this book is one of my new craze books and it started off as a Jermaine fan fiction one then it turned into Sparabeth then Stendon and now it is my Nano Remo draft sort of thing then I've got this which I was going to practice journalism in because it's got the whole who where when what how sort of thing but I ended up not doing that but I just put my like random notes in here like I've got my gecko stuff like to do with my gecko and then I've got lyric ideas because I wanted to be a songwriter a year ago I go through these phases where I want to do different things um school supplies then there's two that I got today the first one is this art deco journal and I like it a lot and usually these cost about five to ten pounds each but I got these two today for two pounds each because they didn't have a price label on so I got them cheaper and the inside's just some red lines and it's really pretty then I've got this one which I love it's quite it's quite a bit bigger than the other one and I love so many things about this it was meant to be six pound I'm guessing something around there but there was no barcode or anything on it so I got it for two pounds and it's sort of a peacock sort of design on the cover then on the inside it's just got black and then I love this it's like a sort of oldish book because it's got cream pages and stuff and I'm going to use this for either my story outlines or I might use it for something better because I want this to be like a sort of clean notebook thing I don't like using like pretty notebooks because I end up wrecking them then I've got this one which I got from the pound shop because I just saw it and I really I can't stop myself from buying stationery it's really bad I've got about 10 of these refill pads that I just use for random stuff I got this in London and I've got the little binder thing in there but I got this in London and it is Moomin I got it from I think it's called Artbox it's in town and in London town centre sort of thing there's one problem I've got with books like this I don't particularly like notebooks with pictures in the corner because it takes up space and it makes us go into the corners and I, I, just, I really don't like it but I love this book it was so cute this new era book and I only managed to get one of these because I had one and then I thought that we were going to sell more so I went back and then they didn't have any more so I'm really annoyed because they are so big and you can fit so much stuff in them which is why I've got all of my Nano Remo prep in here and it's only taken up about that many pages and I've still got all of these. I have, the last one I'm going to show you because it'll take too long for me to show you everything but I've got my uh, research for my historical fiction that I want to start writing so I'm going to get character profiles of famous people and stuff in there and it's like this really cool blue colour so that's my notebook addiction and then I, I like a few other things I like the standard pencils, paper, that sort of thing but I'm not going to bore you with that and um, I have like a draw for each thing and then I've got elastic bands I like boxes as well even if I never end up using them I just buy loads of boxes so I've got this box this box which originally had some socks in it but I thought it was so cool so this box and it's got my threads and things in this box from paper chase which is so cute it's got like a face there and then things and then it's purple on the inside so I like it even more and then I have this 
bird box which originally had some gerbil toys in when I had my gerbils but I don't really have anything in here anymore. This used to be my bobble box for my bobbles and then I turned it into a paper clip box. I've got portfolio sort of things so I think that's all at the minute because I don't want to bore you for too long but um yeah so if you are also addicted to stationery then comment down below and I'll see you next time guys bye. Then I have Great.